If you guys don't like and subscribe in the next five seconds, these big ass kukurachas will actually crawl up in your mouth. I wouldn't risk it if I were you guys. If you guys need your badges right now on 2K21, go ahead and go to plug for badges and accounts. Trust me guys, they're 100% legit. If you guys need your badges done within a couple days, they got you. Again, their links and everything will be in the description guys. If you guys need cheap and reliable MT on NBA 2K21, go hit up mtstacks.com, go to the website, buy MT for any console you guys want. Use my code DAN for 5% off. Again, their links will be in the description guys. So today I'm going to show you guys the VC that you guys have been asking for you can see right there guys i have 131k as of right now by the time i post this little video i should have 300k from this little glitch alone now again if you guys can't do this little glitch or you guys don't want to do this little glitch i have a friend that might do it for you guys go right down the pin comments and you guys should see his twitter or his instagram dm hit him up also i'm not the founder of this little glitch again shout out to my boy meta king because again he's the founder of this little glitch now again you guys do need something called the strike pack or a cronus max or zen i'll leave those little things little i guess things to buy in the description so if you guys don't have one again just hit my friend up if you guys do have a strike pack or a Cornus Max or whatever it's called, right? Basically, you just download this file that I have in the description. Cool. So download that file. Also, I have the little instructions on how to do it if you guys don't understand what I'm talking about. Again, this could basically, I'm going to just give you guys a just or like a summary of what it does. So basically, all you're going to do very simple is, the, I guess, your controller or whatever the script does actually plays my career for you so this is you can go to sleep you can go to school you can go on vacation if you guys want and come back and literally be playing for you guys and making new players for you too so very simple it's the same as like last process you just drag and drop that little file onto your modern controller or your strike pack or whatever click program device press ok and literally that's it you just program that thing and then you just put a setting on your little Cronus Max or your Zen or your Strike Pack. Again, I recommend you guys buy a Strike Pack because again, it's like only 20 bucks, I think, right now. It's on sale. So again, if you guys do want one for 20 bucks and it works for PS5 as well, it's a good investment. You guys can get some VC out of it. You can shoot from across the map if you guys really want. It's pretty easy. Now, once you guys have done all those steps right there where you guys set up the little modded file onto your script, onto your Strike Pack or your Cronus Max or whatever, Go into my career and make a player. Now, it doesn't matter what player you guys want to make. And you guys here, I'm going to give you guys a gist of what I'm doing. So here, you can see I'm moving my controller. So this is me actually playing. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like, basically, when you guys have the script doing. All right. So here, made my player. You guys can copy my player if you guys really want to. I'm going to start the my career. Literally, I'm going to tell you guys what team to go to. All right. So go to this team because, again, if you guys don't go to this team, you guys won't get this amount of VC. And it might corrupt your little, I guess, whole my career file. So don't do this. So just follow what I do. Don't do anything else. Just follow what I do. So right here, skip your my career. Press yes on that. Now, let's just skip your my career. Click on the caps. All right. So I'm going to go on to this little file right here. Not file, but I'm going to go into this little thing right here. Welcome to the NBA, whatever. Look for the Cavs team and then just sim all the way to the next season. Now, the reason why we're going to sim all the way to the next season, because again, we want to get the most amount of VC from this little glitch. All right. So I'm going to sim all the way to my next season because, again, I really want to get the most amount of VC. I don't want to play every game for 500 VC and barely get any VC. All right. Now, when it comes to this little glitch, Literally, it's an AFK glitch. You guys can go take, you know, you guys can go do your homework. You guys can go play a different game on your PC. You guys can go watch TV, go watch the board series or whatever you guys want to watch. It doesn't matter. You guys can come back and literally, it even makes a player for you. All right. And I'm going to show you guys how it works or how it looks like. And yeah, I'm going to show you guys basically how it looks like on my screen. And I'm going to show you guys how I'm playing. I press a button and basically how the script is, I guess, or how the script plays out. So I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about in a couple seconds when I do show you guys how the script works. So here, once I finally sims all the way to next season, press X where I complete the season, whatever. And I'm going to show you guys what to do. It's very simple. It's not even that hard. Here, press X, advance, whatever. Let the little playoff thing, you know, go through, whatever. So here, once you guys go into like next season where it says, you know, pick your next team, you know, this and that, go into free agency or re-sign with the, free, the same team, click on enter free agency. All right. Now we're halfway into the video. All right. And I'm going to show you guys how the glitch works. It's very simple. Again, you guys don't do anything. All right. So here, go into enter free agency and then click on the cast team. All right. So over here, I'm going to click it, right? Enter free agency. Don't click on resign with current team or you might mess up the glitch. I showed you guys proof on how it worked. But again, as of right now, I think I'm still doing it. So basically, after this video is posted, I'm most likely still doing it right now. So click on the Cavaliers once again because it's the highest interest, whatever. 
And now put the offer, the count offer, put 700 or put 780 VC per game. All right, you guys can put 790 or 7, you know, 60 or whatever, but 780 is the mark that you're gonna get accepted for some reason. So right here, I'm gonna just keep count offer until they finally give me that offer where it says 780. So here, bam, 755, counter offer, keep going. There's a final offer, 780 per game, and just click accept right here for four years or whatever. Just click accept. Now, 780 is the most amount of VC you're gonna get. Maybe I guys might get different for a different team, but I don't really know. So here I'm gonna click my brand, put Nike, whatever. And now, very simple. Go into your options, go into settings real quick, and take and put Hall of Fame and take off your vibration. Literally, that's it. You guys can put five minute quarters, put vibration on, and that's it. You're done with the glitch. And now I'm gonna show you guys basically what I do. So literally, you're gonna see me press the little analog stick or I guess arrow down, and that's how you guys start the script. So here I'm gonna press it down, and I'm gonna show you guys, literally, I don't do anything, all right? I just press the analog stick, or not the analog stick, but the arrow down, and that's it, all right? Look, I press it down, and now the script just started. So basically what it does is, it plays the game out for me. So here, you can see my controller, right? basically i don't do anything i don't press anything i don't press x it literally press x for me i can run it can run for me if it really wants to but again this little script is like a basic of the basic so again literally all it's gonna do is just gonna press x move around a little bit but again i'm gonna show you guys literally proof that if i move around it says right there where i press circle i press circle but again with the little script it doesn't show out so here i'm gonna show you guys what i'm talking about so right here when it tells me to sim into the game it should hold x or it should press x on the controller but it doesn't show so basically what this little thing does for some reason right this little script it plays a game out like i guess for you without even telling the controller to what to do which is kind of weird in my opinion but i don't really know so here i'm pressing x but the controller thing doesn't even i guess it even know it's pressing x which is kind of weird but it's whatever and i'm sure you guys proof where like i actually move the controller and it's actually me playing just for like a couple seconds and i'm sure you guys proof right here in a couple seconds on what it looks like so here i'm gonna move a little bit and show you guys and that's me moving all right, so here I'm gonna move like just a little bit and show you guys that was just me. All right, that wasn't the controller. So here, bam, look, I'm moving a little bit. I kind of got fouled or whatever, but again, it's actually me moving. I didn't press X, I didn't do this and that. And right here, when it comes back to offense, I'm not even pressing X. So you can see my controller right there on the screen. I'm, pre I'm not even pressing X. It's the game or a little script pressing X for me. I'm not doing anything at all. Literally, all it's doing for me is just playing my mic here for me. So literally, I can go to sleep right now, wake up, you know, a couple hours later, and maybe have, you know, maybe, I think, maybe 200 to 300K. Because again, it does make players for you. So here, bam, this is what it looks like. Again, all it's going to do is just play the micro game fully without you even being there. All right, and you get 800 to maybe a thousand VC every single time. It just depends on the performance. But again, literally, you guys don't have to do anything. So here, I'm not even touching the controller. You can see right there, bam, on my controller on the screen. I'm not even touching it. Once again, I have my controller plugged into my PS4 and my PC. So literally, I'm connected, and if it does fake, if it is fake, and it's not me with my actual controller, it would say disconnect and stuff like that. So literally, nothing even moved when I pressed X. Or I went down on my analog stick. It's not an old recording. Because again, I'm going to show you guys proof in a couple seconds right now. Where I actually just press circle and I hold for a screen. And I was still pressing X and stuff like that. And I fell down and everything. And that was me actually doing it and not the little script. So I'm going to show you guys in a couple seconds what it actually looks like when if I was to play or whatever. Again, I'm going to show you guys literally live proof that it's actually not me. I'm not doing anything. I'm not pressing X. I'm not on another controller pressing X. I'm not doing this and that. Most likely, I'm going to make another video on this because, again, most of you guys are not going to believe me or you're going to get really annoyed because, again, it's very easy just to do because, again, I'm not doing anything. I can go to sleep right now, wake up eight hours later, and, again, I can still be doing the glitch right now as we speak because, again, it does make players for you. It plays the micro for you because again it plays the whole season until the all-star break and then it makes a whole new player for you so literally you guys can go to sleep right now as we speak right go to sleep wake up your i guess your little controller is still doing all the work for you come back into the game look how much vc you guys have then just come back to the glitch and do it again so literally i'm gonna come to the end of the video and show you guys where i hold skirt circle and i just fall down to the floor and show you guys proof literally i didn't do anything so here, I'm going to go into the fourth quarter and show you guys proof 
like literally 100% proof that this does, does work. Again, you guys see it there, my controller, I'm not pressing X, it press X for me, I'm not doing anything at all. But again, it just presses X for me. So here, bam, on the final quarter, look at my controller. All right, so I'm gonna press circle, hold circle. It's still pressing X for me. I'm gonna fall down the score. I'm tapping circle literally as fast as I could to try to fall down. And literally, that's me pressing circle. All right, I'm not pressing X. That's the script going through pressing X. So literally, this glitch is good to do if you guys are really bored and you guys need quick VC for next gen. Because again, next gen, I think VC does transfer over. So if you guys do need VC quick, quick, and you guys don't want to play, do this little glitch. It's not even that bad. But again, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I'm out, y'all. Peace.